Hey, good morning. Rise and shine. Happy hump day, hump day, hump day. What is it? It's May the uh, 15th, 2019. The Lord gave you another day on earth, and I thanked him for it as soon as I woke up. Yes, I did. Let's put down some coffee or your favorite morning beverage. Let's go. Ah. Well, today's going to be a, a fairly decent day. It's going to be almost like spring today. It's going to be uh, 70 degrees here in central Pennsylvania. The low is going to be about 52. Tomorrow we're going to hit 65. Um, partly cloudy. Oh, partly cloudy today. And then uh, on uh, Friday, it's going to be 70 for the high and uh, 51 for the low and sunny. Uh, I got my favorite shirt on here. One of my favorites. All right. Yakshamash. <laughs> I picked this up uh, at one of our Goodwill places down the road there, you know. I haven't had a good polo shirt in a while. The last one I, the last polo shirt I had, and I still have it. I don't think it fits me anymore, though. <laughs> I had them silk screened. Uh, I had, uh, well, let's see, one, two, three, four of them silk screened. Uh, the, the back of the shirt. It was it was a red shirt just like this, but on the back it said Wars Nikowski. <laughs> okay? And I got one for all of us. Uh, RJ got one, Mary got one, Carol got one, and of course I got one, you know? Uh, that was uh, uh, quite the conversation piece, to say the least, you know? We'd be walking around and we'd get stopped. Is that really your last name? How do you pronounce that? And so on and so forth. So, but, uh, yeah, I seen this and I figured, nah, I'm going to get it, you know. Nice little shirt. And it's not a thick cotton, you know, it's a, a thinner cotton. <clears throat> but, uh, I guess that's, that's enough about my, my wardrobe that I have on today, all right. Um, I got plans today, I got to go down to, uh, I'm going to hit Lowe's and then Home Depot. <clears throat> my, uh. My uh, fireplace uh, thermal coupler, I can't find one, all right? Uh, I did finally uh, find the paperwork for her, the, the model and brand, and uh, I called the company up, and I gave them uh, the serial number, the model number, and all that, and the young man on the phone uh, said, yeah, I know which one you're talking about, but we stopped making that about eight, ten years ago. So, and I've had this uh, propane fireplace um, in the house here for 12 years, maybe. And that's that's the first problem I've ever had with this thing, you know. <clears throat> so, uh, and uh, the gentleman I was talking to on the phone, uh, he said, uh, I'm very surprised that you haven't had other problems because, uh, I guess these propane fireplaces, uh, they'll create havoc every now and then. But I said, no, nah, I've n never had a problem with it, you know. I always maintained it, uh, cleaned it uh, every year, you know, when it would get dusty and all that. And cobwebs or wh whatever was around it, you know. The usual maintenance you have to do on these things, I would do that <clears throat> religiously. And uh, it, was, uh, it was a good investment for me, you know. But... Uh, I guess I'm going to go today and hopefully I'm going to find a fireplace <laughs> in the springtime. You know, uh, I'm probably better off looking in the wintertime, but, you know, I'm hoping I can find one now that maybe it's a, a display model or, a, you know, they just want to get rid of it and I'll get a good price for it. Fat chance, but I'm, I got to do something today anyway. I'm going to go to the YMCA a little bit later on. Uh, this afternoon uh, for my daily uh, workout and walking in the pool, all right? Um, that's about all I have for today for myself. What do you guys have planned? Anything uh, special today or are you traveling in your motorhomes or or maybe you're at work or maybe you're just retired and at home and, and enjoying your time off? Uh, <clears throat> last night... 
I had fried chicken for dinner from Giant, all right? Now, last week's uh, fried chicken that uh, was purchased at Giant, I mean, it was, it was outstanding, I thought. It was more roasted than anything. And uh, this pack, you know, the way it came in, uh, you can't tell until you get it out of the pack, actually. <clears throat> but, uh, <clears throat> excuse me, it was more fried chicken than roasted. It was all right, but uh, I got to watch my salt intake. You know, I, I bit into it and it was eh, kind of salty. So I'm going to see what my, what my blood pressure is going to be like today, you know. <clears throat> I'm really uh, trying to watch my salt intake more often now than what I have had in the past. I was never a real big salt eater. I think I told you guys this before. Um, there's plenty of people out there, and you might be one of them, that you'll sit down to have your dinner, lunch, or breakfast, or dinner or lunch, I should say, and uh, you reach for the salt right away and just hit it. Uh -uh, I never did that. I would, you know, taste my food first, and then if it needed some salt, I'd put salt on it. But very rarely. I'm not a big salt eater, and uh, I never use uh, sugar in my coffee. It's always black. Uh, I used to have uh, a coffee made in it, but that was years ago. I got off of that, and uh, I just drink it black, and that's, that's how I like it. But... Uh, I'm just babbling on <clears throat> so you can enjoy your cup of coffee and uh, listen to somebody else talk, I guess, you know. Um, let's see, what else can I tell you? Oh, Cape May. Uh, Cape May this weekend, it's going to be uh, Wednesday, well, today. It's going to be 69 and lows of uh, 58, partly cloudy. Thursday, it's going to be 70 degrees and the lows of 60, partly cloudy. And... Uh, Friday, it's going to be sunny, and it's going to be around 74 degrees and lows of uh, 62. Um, Saturday, it's going to be 70, lows of 59. Uh, Sunday, it's going to be 69 degrees, partly cloudy for Saturday and Sunday, excuse me. <clears throat> and Sunday, the lows are going to be around 61. And Monday, it's going to be partly cloudy. And 65 and lows of 62 degrees on Monday in beautiful Cape May, New Jersey. And uh, I should be going down there this weekend. i got to see what my contractor did down there uh, on my uh, camper slash trailer. It's always uh, set up in the park there. I've had it now, uh, I guess, nine seasons, nine years, you know. Um, <clears throat> but I needed some, excuse me, I needed some work done on the inside of my camper. Uh my walls were starting to get a little bit soft, so uh, I had a gentleman go in there and uh, rip the old walls out and put new walls in, you know. It's uh, got to take care of it. So, again, I'm just babbling on here so you can enjoy your coffee and I can enjoy mine. Uh, that's all I have today. Uh, no special birthdays today, and uh, we, lost a, we lost a good uh, comedian actor yesterday. God rest his soul, uh, Tim Conway. If you get a chance, uh, keep him in your uh, thoughts and prayers. Say a prayer for him and his family. Um, we're losing him, you know. He was a great actor, great comedian. I, I enjoyed him immensely on the uh, Carol, Burnett, Carol Burnett show, you know, when he did his skit on the, on the elephant with the... <laughs> I thought that was pretty funny. And uh, the other skit were uh, him and Harvey Corman Cor uh, when uh, Harvey was in the, the dentist chair. Remember that one? <laughs> and Tim Conway <laughs> hit himself with the needle <laughs> in his hand for the Novocaine and then pulled it out of there and <laughs> hit himself in the leg. Uh, I mean, I had tears coming down when I was watching that. It was, uh, it was pretty good. Well, that's all I have today, folks. Uh, you have a great day today. Uh, let me know what it's like in your neck of the woods if you could, okay? Um, hope you have a great day. Smile. Have positive thoughts. And thank your God for another day on earth. And pray to your God for peace on earth, okay? I will talk to you guys later on. 
Cheers in Astrovia. Yes. Yakshamash. Okay. And Lachayim. I'll talk to all of you later on. Okay. Keep on smiling. Oh, my radio station that I'm listening to today on iHeartRadio is the Four Tops radio station. Pretty good. If you get a chance, check it out. I'll talk to you guys later on. God bless you. I love you. I really do. Um, thanks for letting me come into your house or your motorhome or camper or even in your office and uh, have coffee with you. Make sure you hit like on this uh, video if you liked it. <clears throat> and uh, please subscribe to my videos and then hit that black bell if you could. All right. I'll talk to you later on. God bless you. Keep on smiling. I'm going to put you out in three, one, two. Here we go now. Smile. <laughs>